Okay. Oops. No, not yet, little one. Huh? No, I was talking to him. Okay, welcome back to the horse. This is a little Mustang named Little One. I'm going to use him to work the other horse behind me who is I forgot his name, man. Rocket. Yeah, Rocket. His name is Rocket. He's one of the rescue horses. He was foaled here. He's out of a quarter horse Mustang. Well, he's, his mama's Mustang is Dad was a quarter horse. So, uh, history on a little one here. He came out in the Nevada prison program. Uh, Hank Curry and that bunch up there, they do pretty good horses. So, if you are interested in a Mustang, I advise you to go to the prison program and adopt them. Uh, some of them needs just a little bit finished. They put extra time on them now than they used to, but they put a pretty good product out I gotta commend them for it so what I want to do here I'm going to get a couple of things done I'm going to get Rocket used to me being above him and plus here in a minute I'm going to be moving Rocket around so he gets used to that saddle bumping him I mean, come in here and hand me that whip real quick, would you? I gotta watch the little one. He gets he's getting a little bit aggressive work on this, but I like you know, since I don't have cows, this is a good place where I start teaching the horses how to track something. So I'm just going to keep it one of the little one's eyes on Rocket. And we're just going to follow him right now. Y'all see me do this with other horses? Just gonna let little one track rocket. In other words, he's just following rocket now. At some point, I'll get up here and reverse rocket. And like I said, I'll let little one track him. So I, I'm teaching little one how to work stock and how to transfer over cows. Right there, I pull little one off a little bit because he's getting a little bit too chargy. Because he enjoys what he's doing. Right there, I just let little one follow him. Now I'll do the same thing with aggressive horse. That's really pushy. I'll do this because, you know, the horse, go from another horse, they're le less likely, it's easier for me to them try to push through a horse and if they push through me, they'll hurt my little body. So we're just going to move them around, control Rocket's feet, right here, we're going to get over here and Move them.
Now if you got a kicky horse, that's why I use either use a bag or into my whip or a whip so I keep that horse away from me. Get a little one off rocket for a little bit. So I had to get in the little one's mouth too hard that time. So we'll back up a little bit and just get right here beside the rocket. You know, from horseback I could get a lot of things done a little bit quicker. Then I can play with saddle. Like I said, Rocker was born here. His mama got him from an auction. Is just a little thing. So, you know, I'm doing this, everything comes into play. Side pass is turn on the haunches. I like, you know, plus the horse I'm riding, it makes them think, and it takes the boredom out of them. You know, this is a real simple way, me getting over top of this horse with it used to saddle. I can wiggle it and everything else. And plus, while I'm out here, up here, I'll get this horse moving his body away using little ones. Get him used to get moving away from pressure. Plus, he gets used to my foot banging on him. That way when I get on him, it's, it's going to be a no-brainer. With that, me, and me getting him light to the bit. See him? The rock is not being resentful. He just put, figured out he's got a saddle on him again.
Oh. The rock don't want me on this other side of them. Unless I'm holding on to them. So I want to set that little one up. So I can. It's getting a little aggressive there, so I just backed them off and we'll ride away for a second or so. The little one enjoys what he's doing. He's really cowy, like right now, he wants to go back to that horse. Now I'm using a Argentine bit on the little one because if you look at his throat underneath there, that's real short. And if I had a just an O-ring on him where my hands are, it's going to be straight in line. It's going to tendency make him put his head up. Because uh, it's just a little short tip bit. I'm getting. You want to grab him real quick? All right, go ahead and. Unclip them and go ahead and unsaddle them. So, anyhow, a short delay there. Well, let me get Rocket out. You know, I'm getting a bunch of things done here. Like I said, I'm getting utilizing everything a little one knows and adding more to it. And also, I'm getting Rocket used to me being over top of them. I'm working rock, controlling Rocket's body and uh, the little one's body, so I'm now transfer to humans too. I'm teaching Rocket to move away from pressure and stuff, push into it. And I'm teaching the little one also to track what it is. And we got a water bottle in the round pen. So, you know, and I enjoy doing this kind of stuff because, like I said, it's Especially a horse that's a little cowy, and like little one is cowy. So with that said, as I always say, be true horse, they'll be true to you. And it's been a miserable week here, it's been in the hundreds. And uh, also be true to yourself, first and foremost, always be true to yourself. And my kids and my grandkids out there, and a special person, or stay like KDA, God bless and take care. Yeah, just set it down right there.